Okay, so there's this incredibly evil app made by the Chinese. And what this app does, it basically, it tricks people into sending pictures of themselves, their friends, their family, whatever. It tricks people into sending pictures of people to the Chinese. And what the Chinese are doing with all of these pictures of people is anybody's guess. But you know, you just know it can't be good because it's the fucking Chinese, man. Look at what they're doing with this Corona Chan shit. I mean, it's just a flu and there's thousands of people dying. They've got 760 million people quarantined? It's just a flu, though. I don't understand. So anyway, this app is called Remedy. And I have felt like I had to give in and try it out. I mean, it's, it sucks that I'm sending pictures of a face to some, you know, evil communist government, whatever. I don't know. So here's the picture. <laughs> This picture is very old. So this picture potentially it goes back to the 90s actually. Late 90s. Then in the uh, early 2000s when I built my first computer and got online I was still playing the Gran Turismo games on the PlayStation. And this chick here was one of the users in the, one of the Gran Turismo forums that I was in a lot. So, I mean this is probably the worst image I can think of that I have as far as like what you can see or whatever, I mean detail. The original size on this image is 193 pixels by 315 pixels. It's fairly small. So yeah, let's uh, see what this evil Remini app does with that picture. It's the original. And look at what it did with that face. I just... I really did not expect it to do <laughs> that much with what it had to work with there. That's fucking insane. Um, and yeah, it's free. I didn't have to pay anything to get this done. The, uh, the only thing, the only catch is that when I sent this picture to their servers, it told me it was going to take 410, 420, I don't know, 400 plus hours. So there, there is that catch. If you're not paying for it, I guess you get put into a queue that can be really, really long. Uh, the upside is that um, I sent this picture yesterday, so it didn't actually take 400 hours to get the results. But holy fucking shit, man. <laughs> it's just insane. I don't know how much more I'm gonna play with this app. You get three free enhancements when you install it. And I thought that there was supposed to be a way to watch ads or whatever to to, uh, get, to get more pictures that you can mess with. Um, they've also got these different modes here that they were talking about. Um, apparently I just have to click over here to try it. Yeah, and then you'll just have to send send the file there. Okay. I don't... I don't know. It, it, it's stupid to sit here and say, Oh, I wish they would give you all these options from, from the whatever. You know, just from the def default one. Um, because they're an evil Chinese corporation and why would they do anything that actually is a benefit now it's got this little uh, it's got this little like slider carousel type interface indicator here this makes me think there should be a second page but I think the second page is just the stuff here which you get pretty much clicking anywhere in the app so but yeah holy shit But again, as a reminder, this is how big her face was in the original picture. I mean, there's just there's just no detail in this image because it's so small. Now I, I really wonder how accurate this is for this person's face. I mean, this is just amazing. And I did not crop this, so 
I guess the app is going to crop. That's weird. Why does it say three of three down here? Oh, what? Oh, okay. I see. Um, if I remember accurately at all, she was allegedly sitting on the hood of a late 60s Mustang. But you can't really see that from the picture, so. But yeah, I mean, I had already seen um, quite a few results that other people have done with this app, and they've been pretty impressive. But holy shit, I was really not expecting it to be this damn impressive. I mean, Jesus Christ. That's just insane. <laughs>